Hello friends, I have for you today the recently released He Reads Truth Bible in the Christian Standard Bible Translation. You may have heard of it, seen some recent advertising for it. Let's get right into some of the details for it. 66 hand-lettered key verses, 125 full-colored charts, and you can actually pause here and read all of the fine details. Smith's own binding. But I have this particular hardcover edition, although it still has a, a great spine here. He reads truth. And this is by Holman Bible Publishers. And let's get right into it. I want to show you, this is almost, even though it's not a study Bible, and it's not marketed as a study Bible, it very much qualifies as one, if you ask me. Things like this in each of the books. Full color maps, as you saw on the back of the description. And then, you know, it has it does have very readable text. Uh, a very, very readable text, I might add, even though some of the bleed through of the different pages can be seen. Um, and if you were to, if you were a coloring person, if you write, underline, and all that sort of a thing, this is maybe not necessarily the best Bible for that. Uh, but it does have a very nice readable font, and the pages are kind of thin. But even though the pages are thin, I will say this look at this here. At each book introduction, like in study Bibles, you know, they have a book introduction. But on these, there is a beautiful artwork here of a key verse. Now, you'll notice uh, throughout all of the book introductions, there is a key verse. Now, actually, I'm going to jump real quick while we're talking about it to the very back here. And I'm going to show you in the very back after Revelation, they have a chart for each Bible has a key verse section. Check that out. Key verse. And so each and every book has a key verse laid out. One of the most memorable and, of course, summarized verses for each Bible. Well, in each book introduction, here we got a timeline, message and purpose. So they add some context, and then they have a reading plan. And depending on the length of the book, sometimes it's six weeks. I know Isaiah, the one for Isaiah is six weeks here. This is for numbers, so four weeks. And then they have a little outline for each book. And this is a really awesome, awesome, especially if you are going to be reading this with friends, if you're going to be doing it a Bible study, a group, men's Bible study. And that's what this is primarily um, the genesis of. I'll actually show you the, the little pamphlet here that it comes with. He reads truth, Worldwide Men's Bible Study, founded in 2015. And so that's where a lot of this comes from, uh, is some, what would help a Bible study go along better is to have things like this, of course, parallels between Moses and Jesus. Things like that help go along people who are new to the faith, people who are young in the faith. Little things like that will help them greatly understand what exactly is going on in this book. Uh, some of the major themes, some of the major events. And especially here in the Old Testament, you know, we're in the book of Joshua, six moments of consecration. So we're going to, you know, summarize and point out major events that are all throughout the Bible. And this is just an excellent, excellent Bible to give somebody, uh, especially who is just starting out, or somebody who is a yearly Bible person. This is an outstanding yearly Bible, because in the back here, they have a reading plan for going through the Bible in a year, which some Bibles do have, and some don't. Now, I will say, this one is excellent. It is very straightforward and has little columns that you can mark out for each day that you complete. It's a great reading Bible through the year. Uh, there's a lot of artwork, as I was showing you at the beginning of each book introduction. And again, along the way, especially in Hebrews, I'm not going to go through all of it, but through Hebrews, there's a lot of these charts and things, you know, what is faith exactly? And of course, as you know, the, the Hall of Faith in Hebrews, we're going to mention all of these people of the faith that are memorable, as Paul lines out, uh, or maybe Luke, depending on who you believe wrote Hebrews. And just little things like that all throughout. Look at this. It, again, not marketed as a study Bible, really, but definitely qualifies as one. 
colorful charts all throughout the Bible. It is outstanding, and if I'm not mistaken, it is on ChristianBook.com for, I believe it's $27.99. If I'm not mistaken, it was on sale recently. $27.99, and this is for the hardcover version. They have a um, True Tone leather soft version, and you really couldn't do much better for a Bible in 2019 than the He Reads Truth Christian Standard Bible by Holman. This is Caleb Bass recommending strongly you get one for a friend, family member, or for everybody in your group Bible study as soon as possible.